Hello, my name is Archie and I'm studying BSc Environment and Development at the London School of Economics. I first learned about captioned when I was doing some research about uh, options for captioning within lectures and classes and I wasn't particularly happy at the uh, software that my university was using at the time and so I thought that it would be good to sort of go to my disability service and through the DSA to see if there was any support that would be available to have more reliable captions. Within lectures, I would often find it difficult to follow what was being said, particularly when someone's talking for a prolonged period of time, uh, or the lecturer speaking for a prolonged period of time. And I found that having captions really allows me to sort of have the reinforcement of both being able to listen to what's being said and then hit, uh, have the captions again. I found uh, very shortly after starting using captions, like the, the speed that, at which it can caption is really valuable because it means that you can almost have like a word for word recount of what's being said as soon as it's being said. So my university invested quite a lot of money uh, when we were recovering from the COVID-19 pandemic in a hybrid room technology, which has also been really helpful for facilitating captioned. Um, so within lecture halls and most classrooms, uh, microphones are installed into the ceilings uh, throughout the classroom so that you're able to access the audio. I also have a wise microphone, like I'm wearing here, that I asked the lecturer to wear and that can be just plugged into my laptop and I can be sat anywhere in the lecture room and the captions will be able to take that audio and process it into real-time captions. Using captions has really made lectures a valuable uh, use of time again for me. Before I was often finding that I wasn't able to take much content from what had been discussed, whereas now I can leave a lecture feeling more confident and understanding of what's been discussed and let go from then to asking questions to the lecturer or to generally form my own personal views around the content of the course.